Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we can discuss how to fix an update is required to use mobile data on this device or iPhone. So how you gonna fix that in iPhone or iOS device? In this video I will tell you more than 5 methods to solve the problem. So first of all you have to close that page and the first thing you have to do is you have to simply restart your device and after restarting your device you have to turn it on again and you have to check whether the problem has solved or not and the next thing you have to do is you have to simply go to settings and after that you have to update your carrier settings for this you have to simply um, go to settings and after that you have to gen go to general and here you have to go to section and here you have to update your carrier settings after that the next trick what you have to do is you have to simply update your iPhone or iOS device and for this you have to simply go to settings and you have to click on general and after that if you click on general then you have to simply click on update and after that you have updated your iPhone you have to check whether your problem has solved or not and if the problem is still there the next trick you have to do is you have to simply turn on the flight mode for 30 seconds and you have to wait for 30 seconds and after that you have to turn it on again and you have to check whether your problem has been fixed or not. If the problem is still there then you have to turn off your device and you have to eject your sim and put it uh, again and you have to check whether the problem has solved or not. For the next trick you have to simply restart your network setting for this you have to go to settings and after that you have to go to general and you have to scroll down and here you have to click on reset or transfer iphone here you have to click on reset and here you have to click on reset network setting and you have to simply reset your network setting and after that the next trick is as you have to simply reset all of your settings for this you have to again go to settings and again click on general and you have to click on reset iphone and here you have to click on reset and after that you have to simply click on reset all settings and after that you have to check whether the problem has solved or not if the, any one of the trick doesn't work for you kindly uh, mention us in, in the comments so that we can help to you. Hope you have liked this video. Can you subscribe our channel?